years, I believed, you know, even as a grown woman, that the teddy bear was like, you know, was a security blanket and that my feelings came from the teddy bear, which, of course, is impossible because the teddy bear is a stuffed toy. But we, if we believe, and I did for many years, as I've said, that something external to me can either create safety or not, then as adults we transfer the teddy bear for things like money, partners, jobs, health. What's the other one? Cars, children, status. Money mm. is money is a big big one for people they genuinely genuinely believe that their security can come from the amount of money in the bank and that's why it's so interesting to notice and get curious because it's changeable and you asked the question why is that and you said it's worse when I'm catastrophizing that's why so if you're activating that stress response everything becomes like a double whammy everything becomes heightened if you're under stress right so if that stress response it's like flight fright or freeze so if i'm in that response everything in my world is now heightened hence why we catastrophize what jack pransky describes that is if you've heard of him it's like the elevator of consciousness so sometimes we are in the basement and we can't see and in the basement it's like frustration, anger, catastrophizing, anxiety, depression. It's like I cannot see, this is really real. And then we start to come up and out of the elevator and as we learn this we can kind of have days where we can see out and you know we can see the mountains and the sea but sometimes we come back down and sometimes in a day I can be up and down, right? Now, I'm less likely to be like that now, but back when I was more up and down, if I was down and I woke up, I just wouldn't trust my thinking. But money for me was a big, big blind spot for a very, very, very long time. <laughs>